Hey guys and welcome back to this channel. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can manually log on an object on CapCut. So there is the option to select log on and log on the like face or the body or the hand and press start, but you do need CapCut Pro for this. So to do this manually, you're just going to go to text first, add in a text. I'm just going to type in the letter O. You can use a dot for it as well. And then I'm going to kind of resize it to the person's face. And I'm going to actually place it in the... Well, try to place it in the middle if it would just allow me to. There you go. And then I'm going to add it till the end of the clip. Oops. um like so and then i am going to zoom in on the video a little bit i don't know why this won't there you go zoom in on the video just a little bit and i'm going to place the um letter here and then on the video you're just going to want to add in a keyframe and place the face like in the middle if it's not zoomed in enough you do have to kind of zoom it in or else it will show like parts of the background so maybe i'll just zoom it like this then add a keyframe and place the face there and then whenever it moves you're going to want to place it in the middle i'm just going to do it really quickly but you have to be a little bit precise with it and it does take quite a long time to do this manu manually. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Just keep on placing the face there. I have a sore throat, so I'm sorry if my voice sounds like bad, but you're just going to want to keep doing that. And once you're done, you're just going to select the text and you're going to want to press delete and it kind of moves along with the center of the like face, like it locks it on. As you can see, but yeah, that is basically it. I am just going to do it for the first few seconds though because it will take me a long time. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and also subscribe to this channel if you haven't done that already. If you have any questions, just leave it in the comment section down below and I'll try my best to answer them all for you guys. And if you found this video really helpful, please click the thanks button above the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!